Shiba Inu lead developer Satoshi Kusama has issued a final warning to all Shiba Inu holders and owners. It has something to do with a long-awaited barium strip. And considering we've all been waiting for this platform to launch, this is one video you can miss, so be sure to keep watching. Disclaimer without a doubt, barium is the most anticipated project in the Shiba Inu community and perhaps even in the broader crypto market. What's more, the fact that there were many disappointments with the platform not launching when the development team said it would add to the overall expectations. So you might want to click when you hear this barium talk because you're used to disappointment but there's already a solid update out there, so please wait there. I mentioned in yesterday's video that Satoshi has tried not to be shy about engaging in discussions with the Shiba Inu community while we all wait for Miriam's release. This is how we discovered that Floating Day and Valentine's Day predictions weren't working. This is also how we recently found out that she will marry him before the end of the first half of 2023. Satoshi mentioned this in response to a Shiba Inu Telegram comment and platform. Well, to be more specific, he mentioned that the platform will launch before May, and given that the development team has been careful not to give any specific launch dates due to the disappointments of last year, it looks like we might be able to trust this before the time frame that he's given. Our brilliant Toshi. It's not as specific as we might want, but it's definitely more specific than we've gone in a long time. So I guess you can call it a step in the right direction. But there is something strange about this that you might have picked up if you watched yesterday's video. In yesterday's video, we talked about Satoshi's response to the Shiba Inu owner on Telegram, telling them that he doesn't have an exact launch date for Siberia. Again, I know saying the platform will launch before May does not give an exact launch date, but if he had this information, why didn't he tell it to this user yesterday? Also, while Team Def didn't announce Food Day or Siberian Valentine's Day release, it seemed as if Satoshi was teasing her. I mean, why else would he have added so quickly learning to play the flute before putting it on? She buried him in a heart-shaped box with a bow to his Twitter bio. What could be an indication, if not barium release? Miriam is even in the statement. It makes you wonder if Satoshi's talk of a possible launch isn't just another thriller. Well, if you think about it too, something that Satoshi recently posted on his Twitter page might convince you. He wrote, here is what I just said in the main Telegram chat that was overrun by Flickering and Shadow Cats. Go enjoy V-Day tomorrow. My first of a series of media introducing the world at Sashi Mariam will be released. The bow fits fine, but I won't release anything until Kaldor Korea is finished. Morning? That's too little to unpack here. First, this tweet was posted yesterday which means that the first blog of the Medium Siberian blog series should be published today. This blog is not a barium launch, nor does it indicate that the platform will launch right away, given that it will be the first in what will become a series. So it is important that we try to contain our expectations before publishing that blog. Secondly, this tweet was just an abbreviated version of something he posted on the Shiba Inu Telegram page at the beginning. The longer version is actually more interesting than the shorter one because the first thing mentioned is that it's Miriam ready. This is interesting because it's something we've all been waiting for. But you have to admit it's also weird given that Satoshi already mentioned that she's going to divorce Miriam before May. Before May. Looks like we won't get it before March or even April. Or am I completely off base? Please share your thoughts on this in the comments section. Tell us what you think Satoshi was trying to imply when he said she would bury him before May anyway. Moving on from that, he also mentioned that he can't wait to show us the beta version of Shibuya. So, another thing Satoshi mentioned that might answer the question of why are you carrying it. Did it take a while to launch this year? He reminded the community that the master barium developer had lost his father so it would be quite disrespectful and was in fact to expect the man to continue working at such a time. Do with that information you will. But I hope the lead developer can improve. So yeah? We should get our first mean mass today, and the barium is likely to be released before the second half of May. We just have to wait and see what more information we get from the Medium blog and also do our best to avoid fluctuations. Satoshi in particular sounded the alarm. But before that, 
Did we get there? This channel is offering 100,000 sheep to participate in this giveaway. All you have to do is subscribe to this channel like this video and leave a comment below. I miss Shiba and you. Good luck. Also, there is now a membership option on this channel. Becoming a member gives you access to a private group. Chat with me where we can discuss crypto jams, finances, and success if you're interested. Click on the membership button. Back to the video. Satoshi stated that he considers himself a target of the FUD campaign. I guess I should just read what he wrote. I'm being targeted by a coordinated FUD campaign and now I know who in another room is doing it. But I won't be showing screenshots. I'm over it. But let it be known they are trying to destroy what we have in the name of society and I won't let them. It's ominous and I don't know about you. But this talk of finding out who was behind the attacks makes me remember the internal squabbling that happened a while ago. I don't know if this current situation has anything to do with it, but consider sharing your opinions on the matter in the comments section below. Also, if you really found this helpful, please leave a comment and share this video with friends. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm, which helps me continue to increase the quality of my videos. Finally, the analysts did their analysis and came to the conclusion that the Shiba Inu could reach the $1 price if a number of factors are put in place. These factors were identified by Bowen's official Twitter account, Shiba Swamp, and they believe that the factors can drive sheep to a reasonable price even in the face of the current crypto market. What are these factors, you ask? Well, it's massive support for the Bowen symbol and also massive support for Barium. The logic is that barium is supposed to help improve the price of sheep anyway through sperm. Hence Bowen is the Shiba Inu code that is supposed to make this possible because the validators and designers whose job it will be to secure the sheep carrying platform will need to have Bowen to work. So to make sure we get full barium services, we need Bowen support as well. At least that's what Bowen's official account said. Given all the talk about sheep and barium, and when it might be fired, it seems we need to pay more attention to what the account says. What exactly needs to be done to show support for Chi Barium? Is it a matter of driving support for the platform in some way, or waiting for it to launch to take advantage of it? Or is it more about planning projects that can be launched on the Barium once the platform is launched? Also, what should be done to show support for Bowen? Should we push for the token to be listed on more exchanges? Or, are we supposed to just buy as many BWIN tokens as possible? If massive support for sheep, barium, and Bowen is important to improving sheep prices, these are questions we need to answer quickly so we can act as quickly as possible. So please consider sharing your thoughts with us in the comments section below. With that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, please like this video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video with as many people as possible. Let's spread this news out there.